To create a desktop video, you need four things. One, the setup. Two, deep house music. Three, B-roll of yourself using that setup. Four, a few interesting things that separates your setup compared to others. But with this entire setup, the star of the show is honestly the brand new Secret Labs Magnus Pro. As now, it has standing capabilities as this is indeed a rising desk. And compared to other desks that I've seen in the market, this is still the best, the most advanced gaming desk or even general desk purposes available in the market because it has an insane, cleverly engineered wire management system because literally the only cable that's sticking out is the power for the desk. And that power cable is able to run everything you see on top. And to this very day, this is still my favorite desk that I like using for its minimalistic look. Now this is indeed a rising desk and the max height that is able to achieve is 125 inches and the lowest setting that you could put this in is 65 inches above the ground. It's a dual motor system that works extremely seamless. It's able to pass the max glass test as it doesn't spill or anything like that and has a max capacity up to 265 pounds. And when I put myself on the table, yeah, it's able to comfortably just raise me up and lower me back down. And note, this is not recommended, but I'm just showing you that yes, it does indeed support heavy payloads if you need to. Now, unique things I like about this Magnus Pro Desk is the controllers. It literally is integrated with the desk itself. And you have three different save profiles to select from. And unlike other ones I tested in the past, it's not complicated. It's, you simply just tap S to save the profile on the dedicated number. So if, once you adjust the height for your personal preference, you just hit save, tap the number you like to save it under, and that's it super seamless and this does actually have an on and off switch and in terms of safety features this does have advanced locking mechanism as well as anti-collision detection so if you're so if you have a box or something like that underneath the desk it's not going to crush it and then on top if you're familiar with the previous generation secret lab magnus desk it also continues to use the same amazing leather-like material top part which is basically like an oversized mouse pad because of this i'm able to use this as my mouse pad without having a dedicated mouse pad but this allows you to actually customize the top part of the desk to your own personal preference as you see there's different designs here on secret labs website but this basically allows your desk to have additional protection and once more you can utilize the entire top part to be your mouse pad now this being a full metal desk you heard me right this entire desk is made of full metal and because of this, Secret Lab geniusly designed a bunch of accessories you could actually attach on this thing to give you even more better wire management options than no other desk available in the market. As Secret Lab sell these separate kits, like the magnetic cable management, which include these full magnetic covers right here. You can actually attach on the legs to hide any cable. It's extremely strong and powerful. They also provide these Secret Lab labeled Velcro strap, tighten up all the wires. And my personal favorites are these red magnetic clips that basically allows you to have quick access to your wires for starting your devices and tighten things if you're using like a wire cable, or if you're using like a wire mouse or keyboard. They also have these headphone holders as well, which you simply just attach on any bottom flat surface of the desk. You can use this to hold your headphones, but what I like to do is sometimes is just allow my gaming controllers to rest up here as well. And then the LED strip you see back here, this is the newly improved Marge RGB. I believe that's how you pronounce it. But this time, there actually is a unique partnership between nano leaves. And that is the lights I have right above as I can actually synchronize these two things to communicate with each other. And it's all app control. And then if you live in the Apple ecosystem, you can actually control it with the Apple Home app. So if you have any existing nano leaves lights around your setup, the desk can actually communicate with all those. But now the accessories doesn't just end there as there's two additional accessories that Secret Lab released alongside with this desk. And that is this new premium PC mount, which actually gets tucked and attaches right underneath the desk. So if you have a desktop right here attached to your desk, you can easily run the cables along the legs and using those little covers I was telling you about, you could basically hide every single cable right here, which is super convenient because previously I used to have my desktop on top of my desk. But due to that, of course, I'll lose real estate space. But now I don't have to worry about leaving my desktop on the floor and collect dust. 
technically it's elevated. And don't worry, the mechanism is super adjustable. It could fit any flat bottom tower. But my favorite accessory of them all is the brand new single monitor arm, which I have actually used to be attached on my brand new iMac. This thing is pretty cool. Not only goes up and down, it seems like it has hydraulics, but in reality, I don't think so. It's just, I just think this arm is just really well balanced. But because of that, it's really lightweight to actually bring up and lower back down. And just like the desk, it has an impressive wire management system as you can easily pop these things down, put the feed your HDMI or USB cable so you have to run through to power your monitor or want to connect to your monitor and just magnetically attaches on and it makes sure that the cables don't go loose if you're constantly moving your arm. So the built-in wire management system, again, is really well thought out and well engineered. Now the arm does have a capacity rating up to 17 pounds. That's the max capacity that's recommended. This iMac weighs about 10 pounds, so it's strong enough to move all one computer like you see here. The arm itself is made out of the same material as the desk, so it's really premium and feels great. Everything attaches extremely well. And you have the freedom to adjust this arm anywhere you want on this desk. I personally prefer to leave it on this edge right here because majority of time when I'm not using this monitor, I could raise it up, move it out of my way. But when I need that computer, I could easily put it back in the center. And then the entire color layout matches the theme of the desk. So it has that nice matte, stealth black look with those red outlines. And then if you lift this cover up, this will reveal the basically where you run all your cables. And it's big enough to actually have a surge protector in here, a big one too. The one I have, I'll have a link in the description as well if you're curious, but this one has a lot of ports and it's able to easily be fitted inside here and keep everything nice and tuck. So this mechanism was the same mechanism that was available on the older desk as well. It has the same wire management space like the, the non-standing version of this desk. Now the entire assembly process literally took me about 30 minutes or less. Super easy. The thing I like about Secret Labs products is that once you receive the package, everything is so well organized that it really does make assembling this desk extremely easy and seamless. And I also like the fact that they provide all the tools necessary for this built. And these aren't just generic tools. These are actually nice premium feeling tools too. So the assembly experience, if you don't have your own tools, it still will be positive regardless. And being Secret Labs, of course, they give you like massive posters and stuff like that, which is quite neat. And you're always guaranteed to always receive the things undamaged or things missing because each Secret Lab product is always hand inspected before it's shipped out to you. So quality control, Secret Lab always is on top. Now the power cord that's used to power and operate this desk, it's extremely long. So if you're concerned about length, trust me, it's long enough. Just take a look. I had to wrap this thing around a couple of times, but it's nice and thick and heavy duty. This is the only cable that will, will only stick out of your desk. So this is gonna be my main streaming room. It's a work in progress, but the cool thing is since this wire management door to have access to your cables. If you're constantly switching things, moving things around, it's really easy to access. But this is basically my current setup. Now the top part of the desk, this is where I usually get my work done. Plenty of space for all of that, especially with that arm monitor mount. I have my iMac attached so I could do my research or browse the web or casually use my iMac when I want to. I still have enough room for my MacBook Pro. And if I feel like gaming with my friends and such, I even have plenty of space for my old man's HP gaming laptop. And the capture card of choice that I use sometimes when I'm actually streaming is this one. It's a 4K capture card, works extremely well. I use it for both next generation consoles as it does capture 4K. And sometimes I utilize this thing to actually connect to the HDMI port on my laptop and just use duplicate screen effect. And I'm able to easily capture my desktop screen just by doing this. Now you may have noticed I don't have a microphone on my setup. That's because lately I've been using the DJI mic. This thing's really cool because it has a USB-C port. So it's compatible on computers. So I don't have to buy a massive like microphone setup like I used to. And it's a dual microphone setup. So if I have a co-host, everything just gets synchronized instantly as the receiver does it all automatically. And then the headphones of choice I personally prefer using is the AirPod Max in case you're curious. So if you also want to recreate the setup, another thing I should also mention is the way I was able to mount this iMac. So something I didn't know early on, Apple doesn't make Visa mounts or Visa mounts. 
I'll have the text right here. I forgot apparently. <laughs> but Apple doesn't make these versions. This is actually fixed on the back part of the computer. So what I did to accomplish this is actually bought this adapter on Amazon and I used the longer screws that the Secret Labs came with so I could actually make it all fit. And I went to Home Depot, purchased these little nuts right here and I just tightened it all up just like so. And now I'm able to actually use this iMac on the arm mount. So if you like to recreate this, there you go. Or you could actually purchase the Visa mount version or Visa mount version of the iMac. I didn't know this was an option. I thought this part was removable. So now you know that's how you could create that if you made the mistake and got the stand version instead of the Visa mount version of the iMac. But thanks to the stand that I have, I'm able to utilize it as I actually have this little dongle hub system right underneath that actually has internal storage and I have quick access to a USB port as well as USB-C and a micro and regular SD slot. I have a link to this dongle in the description as well. I did a dedicated review on it as well, which you could go ahead and watch it right over here if you're curious. All in all, this new Secret Lab Magnus Pro Desk is absolutely amazing. I love the fact that the top part can be easily changed and swapped for other looks. Or if you damage it, you're not left stranded and purchasing a brand new one all over again. You can just replace this top part, just like the older desk was, which I still use to this very day. I still have it on the side of the desk. The top part helps me in so many different ways. But right now, it's currently a workbench that does have a 3D printer and such. But that desk, I've been having it since day one upon its release. It's holding up extremely well. And this one, there's no wobbles or anything like that. It's super solid. And I really do like the partnership with NanoLeaf, which actually does support support future firmware updates so you can actually update the LED light too so if you actually get that accessory with your desk it's pretty advanced. I'll go ahead and launch the app and give you like a quick overview on what I mean. So here's the app I could easily select right now this room that we're in I named it lab if I tap the little teardrop icon I can maximize the brightness I could basically control the lighting right here off my cell phone but in addition to that if I actually go back and click on it in scenes, there's different like themes available for it. So some of this like Cloud Nine, that's one of the things that's app. That's a Secret Lab theme. But if you keep scrolling down, you can find Team Liquid, uh, Secret Lab Signature. So wait for it. Boom, it updates right away. And some of these are actually like voice activated or beats. So if you have music playing in the background, these lights will actually begin flashing. And of course you can favorite them. But it doesn't just end there because you can actually go on to the bottom section right here. You can actually discover community created ones as well. So like this one, for example, blinding lights. I could download it. I could hit play, select the devices. So I'm going to use the other lights too that I have above. Hit OK. Give it a couple minutes for it to switch. And bam, it goes to the beat. It's really cool and awesome. Again, Nano Leafs, they make other accessories too. So if you want to get those tiles and such, you can actually make it all communicate with each other. So if you really love RGB lights, you may want to consider picking up that strip because I'm certainly enjoying it. I'm probably going to pick up more. And there's also motions. Here's the motion tab too I was telling you about. So many you could discover and you create and share with others. And then no, I'm not going to forget. My sheriff's choice is still is the 2022 Titan Evo. But this is still my main share due to the fact that it's just really comfortable. I like the soft leaf fabric because it's breathable. Here in California, weather literally go above 100 degrees for like several weeks straight. So since I'm always behind the desk working, the soft leaf fabric prevents my back from just getting all sweaty. And I like the fact that the forearms actually are removable right now i have the gel pads so my arm my forearms are always kept cool and comfortable when i'm working then other unique features that the titan has the reason why i like it so much is this is magnetically attached which means the back side is always going to look clean and there's a built-in lumbar support in this chair. If you'd like to find out more about the Secret Labs chair, I highly recommend checking out that video. I go more into detail in that video. Aside from that, there you guys have it. That is the preview of Secret Labs' latest standing desk. And no, this was not a sponsored video. You're viewing this video the same time Secret Labs is viewing it as well. There was no contract signed. Only thing that I had to agree on was the NDA once this desk is released in the market, and now it is. They just helped shift out this desk 
a couple weeks early upon its release date so I could have a fair amount of experience and time with it to make this review for you guys because at the end of the day, I'm still just a normal consumer. So I'm just reviewing this like it is. So if you're looking for that clean, minimalistic, no wire showing desktop, this is definitely a desk I'll highly recommend considering checking out. Aside from that, there you guys have it. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any questions about the desk, feel free to comment down below. And if you're planning on getting one for yourself, I'll be sure to include an affiliate link in the video description down below. It doesn't cost you anything. It just sends a small kick back to the channel, which allows me to continue making these independent review videos for you guys. So I greatly appreciate if you actually click on that link if you're purchasing one. If not, it's okay. Subscribing to the channel, it's more than enough, especially if you leave a like. I really do appreciate those. Aside from that, thank you guys so much for watching. If you'd like to check out other videos, once more, go ahead and check out this video over here if you're curious how my experience has been like with the Secret Lab Sheriff, where I, where I go ahead and review the Titan 2022. And then that video over there, that is just a video that you choose recommending specifically for you. Thank you so much for watching. Take care, and I'll catch you all in the next one. See ya.